the clash of love and destiny. Welcome to the second part of how Ma, the moon goddess, fell in love with a human warrior. In the celestial realm, Akio and Ma, the moon goddess, reveled in their love. They traversed the heavens together, their spirits intertwined in an eternal dance. The village below, though unaware of their continued existence, still celebrated their legendary tale. Yet, fate had more in store for Akio and Ma. Far beyond their celestial abode, a tempest goddess known as Siro, the goddess of the wind, had caught wind of Akio's existence. Enthralled by his legend and captivated by his valor, she yearned to claim him for herself. Driven by her fiery desires, Siro set her sight on Akio, determined to make him hers. With her powers over the wind, she conjured fierce gusts that echoed through the celestial realm and could be faintly heard in the village below. The once harmonious heavens became a battlefield, filled with raging winds and clashing forces. As the village inhabitants looked up at the darkened sky, they sensed a growing unrest, unaware of the brewing tempest among the divine. Ma, ever wise and perceptive, sensed the presence of Ciro's jealousy. She knew that their love faced a formidable challenge. Realizing the gravity of the situation, she revealed the truth to Akio, explaining the goddess's infatuation and the ensuing storm. Akio's heart remained steadfast and loyal to Ma, but he knew that their peaceful existence was threatened. He gazed into her eyes, filled with determination and devotion. Ma, my love, I will not let this storm tear us apart. Together, we will face whatever challenges come our way. Inspired by Akio's unwavering commitment, Ma devised a plan. She sought counsel from the wisest celestial beings, seeking a solution to the clash of love and destiny that unfolded around them. Through their guidance, she learned of an ancient celestial trial, a contest of strength and virtue that could resolve the conflicts between the gods. Ma and Akio ventured to the celestial arena, a majestic battleground where gods and goddesses settled their disputes. There, amidst the watchful eyes of cosmic entities, Ciro and Ma stood face to face. The arena crackled with anticipation. With her winds whipping around her, Ciro issued her challenge. Ma, relinquish Akio to me or prepare for war. I will not be denied what I desire. Ma, her gentle radius contrasting the tempestuous might of the wind goddess, stood tall and resolute. Ciro, I will not surrender our love to jealousy and chaos. Let our destinies be decided by this trial. The celestial arena trembled as the contest began. Ciro unleashed furious gusts, conjuring storms and, hur and hurling thunderbolts. Ma, harnessing her lunar powers, cast gentle moonlight that soothed the celestial tempest. The trial raged on, each goddess showcasing her strength and prowess. Ciro's gales battered Ma's lunar light, threatened to overwhelm it. But Ma, fueled by love and compassion, remained steadfast, refusing to let darkness prevail. In the midst of the battle, Akio stepped forward. Holding the celestial flower he had retrieved long ago, he called out to Ciro, Goddess of the wind, I understand your desire, but true love cannot be forced. Love is a choice, and my heart has chosen Ma. Let peace reign, please. Akio's words resonated through the celestial arena, touching the deepest corners of Ciro's heart. The storm within her began to calm, and she realized the true nature of love. Swallowing her pride, she lowered her winds and bowed before Ma and Akio. Your love is stronger than my jealousy, and I see the beauty in it, Ciro confessed. May your love be blessed, and may harmony reign in the heavens once more. 
With those words, the celestial arena fell silent and the storm subsided. The cosmic entities rejoiced, their voices harmonizing in a celestial symphony, their joy reaching the village below. Ma, Akio, and Siro emerged from the arena, transformed by the trial's revelations. Though their destinies had been intertwined by love and conflict, they found common ground and mutual respect. The heavens at the village below celebrated their newfound harmony. Akio and Ma, now stronger and more united than ever, resumed their celestial journey as they transversed the skies hand in hand. The villagers, still unaware of their presence, marveled at the occasional glimmers of moonlight that danced above them. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to support our channel, like, comment, and share. Bye.